Welcome back, Diamonds. If this is your first time joining me, welcome, welcome, welcome. It's your girl, Eva Ture. Go ahead and take a moment to click the subscribe button as well as the notification bell below so that you will become a part of the Diamond Squad and know as soon as I drop another video. So today, I am all about Valentine's Day 2019. I ain't even got no boo, y'all. Let that sink in. I ain't even got no boo, but your girl is happy about Valentine's Day 2019. I'm definitely going to be treating myself to something nice. It's long overdue. Your girl been single for a while. All that good pussy can't find the one to give it to. Right. So, I wanted to get into something super Valentine's Day, something red, something bright, something super glam. I wanted to use some glitter today. I actually went to the MAC counter a couple days ago and I grabbed, they have this collection, I don't know, it's like Ruby, Ruby uh, Woo and everything in that collection is like of Ruby Woo. If I remember um, to put it in a clip, I'll insert a clip of it now. But I got the glitter, the red glitter called Ruby and I thought it was so, 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 so cute. So I did grab that. That was the only thing I got. I should have got the copper. I might go back and get that because I mean we could do some looks with that too that was kind of cute um I just didn't see it as a necessity I was really kind of focusing on Valentine's Day so I pulled out the red glitter the ruby red glitter for back I also dig back and grab my uncensored which is a Fenty Beauty uh liquid lipstick so I'm glad I got to use that today and I also use something new today I use my Fenty Beauty um concealer I I actually went with the shade 390 although I am the shade 430 in the foundation just a little bit lighter a little bit brighter um, I actually really enjoy this I might definitely go back and get the 430 in the concealer just in case on those days you know I don't want all the super glam and I can also use that to um, clean up my eyebrows as well so I'm gonna go ahead and get this look rolling so if you're interested in seeing how I got this Valentine's Day 2019 look you know what to do As a base, I went in with my CoverGirl Demi Matte Lipstick in the shade Worthy. I use it as a base for that red shadow that I'm going to apply just to make sure that it pops. And I'm applying that using my Morphe M224 brush. Next, I went in with my box of crayon palette and I grabbed that red shade on a fluffy blending brush. And I am going to start off by applying that to my crease and right above packing it on and also using windshield wiper motions to blend it out. With that same red shade, I went in with my MAC 239 brush to pack that color onto the lid. Although it is sped up, I did take my time to make sure I laid down that color so that it is super, super pigmented. So once I finished with my lid, I decided that I wanted to bring it up a little bit higher on my brow bone. So I just took that fluffy bending brush that I used earlier. I packed it with more color and then I am carefully packing some more color on, blending it out, making sure that I achieve the shape that I want. To highlight my brow bone, I grabbed my James Charles and Morphe Collab Palette and I went in with canvas with my Luxie Angled Blending Brush. To make sure that there's no harsh lines between red and canvas, I went back in with that fluffy blending brush to clean up those edges and blend that out so that there is no harsh lines. To prep my lid for the glitter, I went in with a small detail brush and I am packing on the NYX glitter glue. To apply Ruby to my lid, I did grab another small detailed brush, which I sprayed with Matte Fix Plus before I dipped it into the glitter. Moving on to the face, I did grab my Cover FX Power Play Foundation in the shade G110 and I did apply that with a damp beauty blender. 
To highlight my face, I grabbed my Fenty Beauty Concealer in the shade 390. I absolutely adore this concealer. It's creamy, it's medium to full coverage. I think this may be my new holy grail. To set my concealer, I am going to use my Pretty Vulgar Translucent Setting Powder, and I'm gonna use the same damp beauty blender that I use for my foundation. To contour, I'm gonna go in with my Black Opal Foundation Stick in the shade Black Walnut. As usual, I'm gonna bronze my face using the Estee Edits Bronzer in Medium Deep. Now with an angle brush, I'm gonna go back in with that foundation stick in Black Walnut and use it to contour my nose. To help control that powdery look, I'm gonna go in with the Morphe Continuous Mist Spray to highlight, I am going to grab my Ulta Beauty Tapered Highlight Brush. I'm also going to grab my Huda Beauty Bronze Sands Palette. And I am going to go in with that shade Aruba. To help my highlight pop a little bit more, I'm going to grab my Maybelline Master Chrome Metallic Highlighter and Molten Topaz. And I'm going to place it on top of that Aruba. To set this red look off, I went in with my Fenty Beauty Uncensored. So I decided to go back in and line my lips with my Aaliyah and MAC collab. It's called Follow Your Heart. It's the only thing that I got from that collection. It was really, really a big disappointment for me, but that's neither here nor there. Diamonds, I hope you enjoyed the Valentine's Day look. Please go ahead and comment, like, and subscribe. And diamonds, as always, until next time.